Hello, oh, everybody. It's me, Carmine DiStefano, the Bookman. Every now and then, Square Enix does something uncharacteristic. They make a good game. And that was the case with the series on the DS called Bravely Default, which they now moved with a sequel, an actual sequel, to the Switch called Bravely Default 2. What do I think of this game so far? Well... Now that I've been able to put over an hour as opposed to about 40 minutes into this game, I can say with full confidence that what I was hoping for is what I'm getting. I'm getting jobs, I'm getting different, which are different classes, I'm getting different combat styles even though we haven't really gotten into them yet. And now the question is, do they have the secret bosses with more asterisks? or job titles that you can utilize to improve the different settings and what have you that you have with each character? Or are there going to just be whatever bosses you fight, whatever aspects you have? I'm pretty sure they're going to have hidden things. So it'll be interesting to see where this progresses. And of course the storyline is your typical Bravely Default. For those of you that have never played a Bravely Default game before, Basically, it's about a princess, or a priestess, this case a princess, who has to protect the crystals. Because if not, there will be a whole calamity coming upon everybody, as the crystals control the four elements. So now, we have to take our seafarer, and all the people that we meet along the way, to save her and help her on her mission. Real simple, nothing over the top, nothing that comes out of the blue, no oh Henry aha moments yet. Yeah, you never know, it's a JRPG. But... Right now, with the combat system as it is, the controls being good for, you know, and the setting and the art style being really endearing, I'm looking forward to getting through this game with all of you. Overall, JRPGs are still the thing, so if you like them, you're going to love Bravely Default 2. If you're not really into JRPGs, but stylish type games and fun little romps through fantasy worlds or your type of thing, take a look. You'll never know. If you're not into a slow strategy-based game, there is some speed to it, so maybe you want, might want to take a look at it. And if you don't care about any anime or any of this stuff, this is not your title. Thank you all for watching. I have more for you soon to come. So stay tuned, take care, and have a great day. Watch him. Watch him. Monsters.